Hi everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So I am a little bit scared <laughs> of this video because I thought today I would film my entire owned TBR, so all the books that I own physically and all of the books that I own on my Kindle. I think it was Becca from Becca in the Books that I first saw do this video but I've also seen quite a few people <laughs> doing this video recently and I really enjoy seeing the books that other people have on their TBRs so I thought now was the perfect opportunity because it's a new year. I'm actually filming this on the 1st of January so I like the idea of having this video to look back on at the end of the year to see how many books I did end up reading from my physical TBR and my Kindle TBR. Also we're getting a new bookcase in tomorrow so this room is already chaotic so it doesn't matter if I make a complete mess of the place and um, yeah I have a feeling this video is gonna get messy so we're just gonna roll with it and hopefully everything works out okay. I also wanted to mention because I live with my partner we share bookshelves and so there's some books that he owns that I'm also interested in because we read similar genres. However I'm not going to include any of those books in this video because I don't want things to get too confusing and also those books have already fulfilled <laughs> their life goal because they have been read just not by me. <laughs> if you do see me mention any books in this video that you would recommend or that you'd like to see me read then please leave me a comment down below and at some point I will do a reading vlog where I read recommendations from this video. I think it depends on how many comments I get how I do that vlog. I'll either do a random comment generator or I'll read the most popular books and do like a tally. I will leave timestamps in the description just in case you would like to skip ahead at any point if there are any particular genres that you're interested in but I'm gonna start with my physical TBR and fantasy books. So first up we have Fool's Errand by Robin Hobb which I am technically currently reading but I'm still gonna count it as the first book in this video. I should have said actually I'm literally just gonna hold up the books and tell you the name of the book and the author author because otherwise this would be a very long video but next up we have Crown of Midnight by Sarah J Mass as well as the rest of the Throne of Glass series. These also aren't in any particular order but I promise I'm going to stop rambling now. So next up we have The Atlas Six by Olivia Blake and The Atlas Paradox by Olivia Blake. Six Crimson Cranes by Elizabeth Lim and also The Dragon's Promise by Elizabeth Lim. The Final Strife by Sarah Al Arifi. Pantomime, Shadow Play and Masquerade by Laura Lamb. The Name of the Wind by Patrick Rothfuss. The Priory of the Orange Tree by Samantha Shannon. A Master of Jin by P. Jelly Clark. The City of Last Chances by Adrian Tchaikovsky. Silver Under Nightfall by Rin Chepeko. Amari and the Night Brothers by B.B. Alston. Moving on to sci-fi we have Winter's Orbit by Everina Maxwell. The Long Way to a Small Angry Planet by Becky Chambers. Lost in Time by A.G. Riddle, Mindwalker by Kate Dillon and The Immortality Thief by Taryn Hunt. Next up we have my thrillers, mysteries and horrors starting with The Green Mile by Stephen King. Things have gotten worse since we last spoke by Eric LaRocca. This also includes a few other short stories. Murder on the Orient Express by Agatha Christie. Ford County by John Grisham. The Devotion of Suspect X by Kigo Higashino. Bullet Train by Kataro Isaka, Rabbits by Terry Miles, and finally Notes on an Execution by Dania Kukafka. Next up we have literary fiction, contemporary fiction, and historical fiction, and just general fiction that I wasn't sure how to categorise, but starting with Freshwater by Akweke Emeze, and Every Morning The Way Home It Gets Longer and Longer by Frederick Backman, and also Brit Marie Was Here by Frederick Backman, Little Prison by Iona Bannister, Detransition Baby by Tori Peters, Girl Woman Other by Bernadine Evaristo, American Royals by Catherine McGee, Godmersham Park by Gil Hornby, Lessons in Chemistry by Bonnie Garmus, and Betty by Tiffany McDaniel. Then I also have a couple of romances, so The Fine Print by Lauren Asher and My Mechanical Romance by Alexine Farrell Falmouth. The one non-fiction book I have on my list is from Friends, Lovers and the Big Terrible Thing by Matthew Perry. Then finally I'm just going to quickly run through some classics which I do also I think 
think, own on my Kindle, but I own the physical copies, so I might as well also mention them in this section. But we have Oliver Twist by Charles Dickens, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll, The Picture of Dorian Gray by Oscar Wilde, Northanger Abbey by Jane Austen, and also Mansfield Park by Jane Austen. So those are all the books that are currently on my physical TBR. I'm now going to quickly run through my Kindle TBR, and these won't be in any particular order because I can't sort them by genre. And I did want to mention actually, if you see me skip any books, then it's either because they're not mine, <laughs> they're my partner's, or it's because I've already read them, but Kindle hasn't marked them as read. I'll put the screen record in here so you can see, but first up we have Pestilence by Laura Thalassa, A Curse of Roses by Diana Pingicha, The Defence, The Plea, The Devil's Advocate, and The Accomplice by Steve Kavanagh, The Soulmate Equation by Christina Lauren, Window Shopping by Tessa Bailey, Us Against You by Frederick Bachman, The Quarry Girls by Jess Laurie, The Stroke of Winter by Wendy Webb, A Day of Fallen Night by Samantha Shannon, The Marriage Act by John Mars, A Shadow in the Ember and The War of Two Queens by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Set on You by Amy Lear, Honey and Spice by Bolu Babalola, Reputation by Lex Croucher, The Flames of Albion by Jean Menzies, Finley Donovan is Killing It by El Cosimano, Infamous by Lex Croucher, On Rotation by Shirlene Obuobi, The X Talk by Rachel Lynn Solomon, Things We Never Got Over by Lucy Score, Broken Summer by J.M. Lee, Hope to Die by Cara Hunter, Flowers for Algernon by Daniel Keyes, Good Girl Complex by L. Kennedy, The Skeleton Key by Erin Kelly, The No Show by Beth O'Leary, The Liar's Girl by Catherine Ryan Howard, Twisted Love by Anna Huang, West Side Love Story by Priscilla Oliveira, The Lies of Loch Lamora by Scott Lynch, Red Rising by Pierce Brown, North to Paradise by Usman Umar, A Train to Moscow by Elena Gorokova, The Eye of the World by Robert Jordan, Daughter of the Moon Goddess by Su Lin Tan, Skyward by Brandon Sanderson, The Mask of Mirrors by M.A. Carrick, Master of Sorrows by Justin Call, A Memory Called Empire by Akadi Martin, The Jigsaw Man by Nadine Matheson, Kingdom of the Wicked and Kingdom of the Cursed by Kerry Maniscalco, Iron Widow by Zarin J. Zhao, Midnight in Everwood by M.A. Kuzniar, She Who Became the Sun by Shelley Parker Chan, The Travelling Cat Chronicles by Hiro Arakawa, Redemptor by Jordan Ifweko, The Burning Girls by C.J. Tudor, Traitor's Blade by Sebastian D. Castell, The Five by Hallie Rubenhold, The Couple by Heli Acton, The Appeal by Janice Hallett, The Devil in the Dark Water by Stuart Turton, The Fifth Season by N.K. Jemison, Crown of Feathers by Nikki Pau Preto, Ray Bearer by Jordan Ifweko, Kingdom of Souls by Renna Barron, I Have Always Been Me by Precious Brady Davis, The Girl with the Louding Voice by Abby Dare, Empire of Sand by Tasha Suri, The Worst Best Man by Mia Sosa, The Split by Laura Kay, The Way of Kings and Words of Radiance by Brandon Sanderson, A Deadly Influence by Mike Omer, The Whisper Man by Alex North, Rebecca by Daphne du Maurier, Wolf by Wolf by Ryan Groudin, Royal Holiday by Jasmine Guillory, Confessions of a Curious Bookseller by Elizabeth Green, Ready Player One by Ernest Klein, Serpent and Dove by Shelby Mahurin, Why Mummy Drinks by Gil Sims, I Am Not Your Baby Mother by Candice Braithwaite, After the End by Claire McIntosh, Dominicana by Angie Cruz, China Rich Girlfriend and Rich People Problems by Kevin Kwan, I Am Pilgrim by Terry Hayes I think is the author, it doesn't actually say on the front cover that I can see, Forever Interrupted by Taylor Jenkins Reid, Opium and Absinthe by Lydia Kang, Sorry I Missed You by Susie Krauss, Once Upon a River by Diane Setterfield, The Prison Doctor by Dr. Amanda Brown, Why Mummy Swears by Gil Sims, Three Women by Lisa Tadeo, Friend Request by Laura Marshall, The Secret Life of Bees by Sue Monk Kidd, My Husband's Wife by Jane Corrie, The Girl in the Ice by Robert Brinzer, All the Bright Places by Jessica Niven, Now You See Me by Emma Houghton, All the Light We Cannot See by Anthony Doer, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll, Twelve Years a Slave by Solomon Northup, Treasure Island by Robert Louis Stevenson, The 39 Steps by John Buchan, A Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickens, The Jungle Book by Rudyard Kipling, The Secret Garden by Francis Hodgson Burnett, Emma by Jane Austen, Persuasion by Jane Austen, and Mansfield Park by Jane Austen. Okay, I think those are all the books that I needed to talk about in this video. I know what's going to happen, I'm going to start editing this video and I'm going to realise that I missed a stack somewhere, but yeah, that is my entire owned TBR. I will put a number 
TBR on the screen here, just so you can see how many books there actually are on my TBR. But yeah, like I said, let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if you'd recommend them, because I would like to do that video at some point. <laughs> Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and click subscribe if you would like to see more videos from me. But otherwise, I will see you next time. Bye.